What is up guys? Welcome back to another North Star Fishing video today. It is trout opener for 2022. Um, we are heading out for some rainbow trout on a stocked um, designated trout lake by my house. And hopefully we're going to get some. I haven't ever caught rainbow trout through the ice, so today is going to be my first time doing that. And uh, yeah, we're going to get there, put in some spoons. It is um, a little bit sunrise. It's the end of sunrise right now. It is... Um, it's kind of cold. It's like three degrees and it's 8.01 in the morning. So I'll see you guys hopefully out at the lake. Fish just raced up to my bait. I don't know what it was guys. I just turned on, or it just dropped down, and a fish already raced up to my bait. There's a fish right on it, right under it. Could be a trout, who knows. Got one, got one. No, I just lost him. No, no. I just had a trout on, dang it. Ton of trout, come on. I'm marking multiple fish. Well guys, I got one. Here is my first rainbow trout through the ice. He is a 13 incher. Um, basically 12 and a half, but really beautiful fish. Um, stocked rainbow. Here we go. I got him off camera. I was dead sticking my rods. And um, I saw a tap, so I lifted it up, started jigging, set the hook, and then I couldn't reel because my reel was frozen, so I, had, I walked back like 10 feet. But there we go. Beautiful fish. Hopefully I can get one more, and then I'll show you guys the catch and cook of this guy. Well guys, the GoPro died again, but I got another trout. Um, got him on the Gamma Scud from Euro Tackle on a Wonder Bread Clam Jig Head. Another decent one. This one's bigger than the other one, it looks like. And um, yeah, there was a school one down there that came up and this guy smoked it. So I'm going to go grab a measurement of him. This guy is a 13 incher here. So PV, rainbow trout through the ice. Well guys, got another one. Um, yeah, they are really aggressive down there. Still hitting the Gamma Scud on the Clam Jig Head. Uh, but yeah, there we go. Another nice rainbow. Really fun catching these guys. They're really aggressive down there. They're just coming, swooping through and hitting the baits. All right, guys, I got a nice one here. This is definitely the biggest one of the day. Um, this one came in, ate the same lure that I've been using all day. And uh, I also lost a really big one at the hole earlier, but this is a nice one. This makes up for it. Um, so yeah, um, let's get a measurement on him. All right, guys. So he is a 14 inch or 14 inch trout. Let's get him right back down. Another one, guys. Absolute clobbering on them right now. I don't know the length of this one. I'll get a quick length. But um, yeah, such beautiful fish. Look at that. But yeah, we're we're smoking them right now. Tons of fish. All right, let's get him back. Here we are with another trout, guys. Absolutely smoking them out here. But yeah, so I'm not even gonna measure, measure this guy. I'm just gonna get him right back. All right, I'm about to get one, guys. There's a trout right on me. He's right on it again. Got him, got him on video, finally. Can't get any trout catches on video today, apparently. Oh, he's right under the pole. Here he comes, there he is. Oh, he just popped off right there. Wow, look at this one. This one's a cool stock dark one. Look at this. He's like reddish. More than the other trout were, but there we go. You can't hold oh my goodness. You can't hold these fish without them squirming everywhere, but here's the trout. Nice rainbow. There we go. Another one guys. Another one, guys. This fish was incredible. Let's get him back. This fish, so the bottom, you guys can't see, but the bottom was right here. This fish, he followed it up, hit it once. He missed it. I dropped it back down. He came up and ate it while he was falling, and I missed him again, and then I dropped it back down. You can't even see, but I dropped it back down again, and he ate it on the way up, and I hooked him and caught him. That was insane.
making trout, so I decided to cook it whole today because it was just I just pull the skin right off. Um, but you waste a lot of meat when you have to fillet it. You can use a lot of meat, and if you cook it the whole, which a lot of people cook their um, trout whole, either grilling, oven baking, or whatever. But I just fried it today. Um, yeah, you get all the meat off the fish really good. So I seasoned it with the seasons that you saw, um, and you just coated. Coat the outside with some, sprinkle some on the inside, and then there you go. So, the bones literally, wow. The bones literally just fall right out. You can pull them right off. Look at that. They just come right out. They're little thin bones, which is obviously sucks because no one likes pulling those out, but... Yeah, they mostly just fall right out. Hmm. The skin is actually good. It's crispy. Yeah, it's scales, but scales kind of like disintegrate, so it's just like the crispy skin. That's really good. Well, yeah, so dark, nice rainbow trout meat. First time ever catching them through the ice. Um, first time ever catching or tasting a rainbow trout meat that's not a steelhead. Um, in one of the corners, there's a link to the video of that, but yeah. Um, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Stocked trout catch and cook. Caught a bunch of them today. Really fun. Um, I'll be catching more uh, stocked trout this winter because they are obviously um, a really abundant in that lake because they just got stocked and today is opener. So yeah, I'll probably be back at the same lake or a different uh, designated trout lake uh, next weekend. So stay tuned for that video. Hope you guys enjoy this one fishing video. Like, subscribe for more. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you guys on the next one.